the State of the Union address. All right. Um, what do you think about it before we even get into, um, uh, you know, the whole uh, itinerary here? What, what do you what was your impression about it? The State of the Union address, whether it's given by a Democrat or Republican, is to do literally what the title says, to give the Congress and the constituency, which is the citizenry of the United States, the status of the Union. I thought Trump's speech was terrific, maybe the best speech he's ever given. Um, I felt that he uh, tried hard to be a unifier. He said he was going to do that. I thought he did an excellent job of doing that. Uh, he recognized some important milestones, which I thought were really uh, valuable to, be, to bring to the notice of the people listening. Uh, the highest employment figures in the history of a number of definable groups. African Americans have never been um, more employed than they are today. Uh, Hispanic Americans have never been more employed than they are today. Asian Americans have never been more employed. Women have never been more employed. So when you just start with those numbers, it's a tremendous success. And if that's all that had happened, that would be terrific. Then he went into the jobs numbers, the economic growth, the economy's booming. Uh, these are really, really great things, Jermaine, whether you're Democrat or Republican. I was impressed. I thought he did a decent job of not pounding people over the head with a hammer, but at the same time saying, this is really good news, you guys. Uh, we ought to all be in this together, and we ought to celebrate together. The interesting side note to that is how orchestrated those that don't support the president are in their opposition and eye-rolling and face-making. I mean, the, ki the king of that in the audience was Bernie Sanders. <laughs> Uh, he, he, he looked like he had something really bad to eat, uh, especially when the president said, we are not a socialist country. We will never be a socialist country. We will always be free. I thought Bernie was going to fall over with a stroke. 